David, testimony begins today for Billy Hawk, the man accused of murdering another man 35 years ago. Stephanie Tanastasi was in the courtroom. She joins us now live with what happened. Stephanie. Kevin Latricia, in 1981, Max Salyer's remains were found in a barrel in the Tennessee River. Today, inside this courtroom right here, four people testified, including Billy Hawk's ex-wife, Deborah. She, along with the state, believe that Billy Hawk should be locked up for life. Billy Hawk sits quietly next to his team of attorneys, hoping the jury in this case finds him not guilty. Today, the state called four witnesses to the stand. The first one, former TBI agent Lance Saylor. I did have some experience working with the Hamilton County Sheriff's Office narcotics work there. He went undercover and said he bought drugs from people like Max Sawyer and Billy Hawk and then arrested them. The only statement post arrest that you can recall Johnny Max Sawyer making was that Billy Hawk had drugs in the garage. Isn't that true? To that effect. The second witness to testify, former Sawney Daisy Ambulance Service EMT manager Harry Stone. He describes what the barrel smelled like when they recovered it from the Tennessee River. The smell of human decomposition is like no other. It's a sweet, sickening smell. And uh, this was very, it was very, very strong. The next witness the state called today, a former Hamilton County Sheriff's deputy. John Hamby was one of the men who pulled the barrel out of the river back in 1981. There were a couple of holes burnt in the top of it, and then uh, five holes burnt about three quarters or about two thirds of the way around the side. There were five other holes, and the lid was had a metal seal on it. The most emotional testimony the jury heard today came from Billy Hawk's ex-wife, Deborah. She testifies she got into a bad fight with Billy one night. This happened four years after Salyer's body was found. I'll stuff you in a And I tried to scream and put it in my hand over my mouth. During the cross-examination, Deborah testifies that she knew Billy was involved in this death the whole time. Deborah also testifies that she had gone on a boat ride with Billy Hawk before Salyer's body was found. They went on a boat ride in the Tennessee River and they dropped off a barrel in the river. She also goes on to talk about the abusive relationship she had with Billy Hawk. She says that the two got a divorce four years after Salyer's body was found. Reporting live in Hamilton County, Stephanie Sanastasi, News Channel 9. Stephanie, thank you. That testimony will pick up again tomorrow morning at 8.